All right, you ready for this? All right, there are a lot of things to know with Caitlyn. All right, here's 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 the basics. All right, every time you want to put a trap down, you should auto first. Nine times out of ten, like that. Right? Auto cancel. Right? Auto cancel. Easy. Auto cancel. Just do that. It's just trap, trap, trap. And you throw an auto right before you trap. Right? You must do it the instant you auto. Right? You want to do it so fast you're almost canceling your auto. You see this? You see this? Give me my give me my mana. Right? Auto cancel. First thing you must know is the auto cancel, right? And then you can expand it into net into trap, right? So if you do net into trap, right? Or if you want to get even better, you put it right on top of them so that they get trapped again, right? If you hit them with a the net, you can put down a trap, right? If you hit them with a the net, you can put down a trap. If you hit them with a the net, you can put down a trap. Hold on, I just fucked up there. See? You can put a trap down. If you hit them with a the net, alright? You should always know the distance of your net. See? That's not gonna hit, right? That's not gonna hit. But if I step a little bit closer, that's not gonna hit either. This is gonna hit. So you smart cast, you smart cast for the speed, but also you should only smart cast when you know the exact range, right? This is like max range for Q right here. About. It's a little bit, it's still, I can I can go a little bit back, but beyond that, it's gonna be like really hard to hit, right? This is gonna be really hard to hit. Even back more. And a little bit more is like impossible. Almost impossible to hit this. This is insane range though. But you should know if you can hit them or not. See, that's that's not possible. This is possible. Alright. You need to know all your ranges. Your W, you need to know this is an important range, right? Remember, your net range is your W range. So if you can hit them with the net, you can hit them with the you can hit them with the trap. I think. <laughs> I think. I'm actually not sure. Because sometimes sometimes when I do it, the trap doesn't go off. Alright. So once you can do that, you have to do uh the net trap, right? Now you have to do other things like net trap a different direction, right? Hold on, can we can we clear these traps? I don't think so. Um, but you have to be able to. Can you put a trap over here while you net this guy? Yes, you can. Look at that. See that? All right. If you net this guy, you can trap this guy and then hit this guy, right? You can do a lot of things, but you have to be able to know these basics so far, and then. And then you have, uh, what is it? Q flash? You have to be able to do that too. Like, okay, say Thresh is uh, throwing a hook at you. The instant he winds up, you can do this. Oh, whoops, that's not, that's not right. You can do this and then put a, and put a trap down, right? Boom, he's dead, right? As long as he's like, he's like half health, right? He half health, so he's chest all in. And uh, you know he can't move, right? Remember how we did the whole... Uh, thrash hook flash thing. It doesn't work, right? It doesn't work. You can't flash. So the instant he winds up hook, you know he can't move. So you just do this. Boom. Dead. Right? Also, you can uh, cancel auto. You can, uh, what's it called? Your trap targets or like targeted targets. Like this is like targeted. They don't count as in, they, they can like auto attack reset, right? So if I trap this guy. Hold up. I didn't do that right. Is this right? No, hold up. Net trap auto auto auto. Right, it isn't. It, it auto cancels. You get the idea. Um, but you need to you need to you need to how, you need to know how to do all that in order to play Caitlyn effectively, in my opinion. Right. Um, you need to do this. You know how to do this. And then here's here's the crazy shit. Okay. Well, this is this is something else, but um. If you wanna like, if you wanna like surprise people or like, the instant you ult, you know they're gonna throw a skill shot at you. You can just do this, so that they throw a skill shot here and they miss. But you can't do it in the middle of your ult. Right, it'll just cancel, right? Okay, here's the crazy thing. This is like, this is the this is the stuff that like LCS players have trouble doing. When you net flash, it's very interesting, right? So if I net in this direction, I get pushed back. So I net flash. Whoa, what the fuck? Okay, if I net flash, that's what happens. All right. Let's watch it again. Netting in this direction, flashing over here. Hit the scuttle crab. All right. Hit the scuttle crab. Whoops. All right. It pushes you. When you aim in this direction, it's going to push you back. No matter where you flash. So if I go this way, I go this way. It doesn't matter. It's pushing me. It's pushing me the direction. 
away from uh, Caitlyn's body. Like, if you orient yourself this way, you're you're orienting yourself along this line. When you flash, you're still al along that line, right? You're still along that line. I just canceled that there, but you're still along that line. Does that make any sense? Also, I don't even know what happened there. Some of this shit is weird. Right? You see what's going on? So if I want to hit this guy, if I want to hit this guy, but I want to, I want to look like I'm netting this guy. I do that. Right? Yeah. See, I don't know what happened there, but right. It's like fake. Oh, that was fucking weird. That was crazy. I don't know. I don't know what happened there, but it just got canceled. Um. Right, you have to know which ones you go over. You say you can say like it's not necessary for you to know this shit, but then if you don't know how to do this, why are you playing Kaylin, right? Right. What's the point? What's the point when you can't do any of this? Then it's just like you're like half as useful, you know what I mean? So you should be able to do like all of that stuff. Hold up, can I like teleport back to base? Give me a sec. And then, like, the hard part about Kaylin is, like, moving and shit, too. Um, we should buy this shit, and then, like, this shit, and sell this, and sell this, and then we want, like, this shit. I don't know, like, I wish we could, like, practice with a Lee Sin or something, but something like this. We need more attack speed? Let's get more attack speed. Why not? 2.5? Almost. Not quite. Alright, cool. You need to be able to, like... You need to be able to carry late game, right? You have to be able to auto attack, cancel, like auto attack move and stuff. So just like practice this. If you can't do this, you should probably learn how to do this. Right? You should be able to pick out your targets, the ones you want. And never, you don't want to use your Q when it gets to later in the game. Right? You don't, you don't want to use your Q because it's too long, right? So your Q is only used until you have like two, three items, or if they're out of range. And then, this is why I say Kaylin is like the most mechanically intensive AD carry, right? You have five traps, and you have a net, and you have flash, and you have like whatever actives and shit. So when you're trying to kill these guys, what's the fastest way to do it? Do you even know? Because I don't, right? How many auto attack cancels do you need to do? Right, hold up. It's like, you can like trap, auto, net, trap, auto. Look at this. Look at that. What the fuck did I just do? Like, I don't even know what I just did, right? Like... You have to you have to be able to trap between every auto attack. Remember what I say? You you can trap between every auto attack. It's like you have to trap the instant this is like on cooldown. So it's like 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 what? It's too hard. It's too hard. That's why I don't recommend playing Kaylin. But if you want to, if you really like Kaylin, you should try and learn this stuff. Um, because you'll be ahead of everyone else who tries to play Kaylin, right? Anyways, that's all. That's all, Caitlyn. That's Caitlyn in a nutshell. Wait, I didn't want this. Do you guys want Ezreal or do you just want me to queue up? Should we do Ezreal or should I just queue up? Lucian, will you be putting this on YouTube? Uh, we can, I guess. We can do Ezreal. Here we go. Ezreal, Ezreal is like real, real crazy. This is my, this is my favorite. Okay, this, this is very easy. It's like the Caitlyn tricks are like really hard to think about and use in game. Ezreal is like really easy to think about and do in game. All right, it's easy. Ezreal is easy. Easy is easy. So in my opinion, there are three like flash tricks with Ezreal, right? Um, let's just like uh, level up and then uh, auto refresh all this shit, and uh, let's just teleport somewhere. Ooh, let me teleport. Spawn enemy dummy. Okay. Okay, whatever. Okay, sick. Okay, so you can queue, right? No, you range of your queue. 
right? You don't want to do that. You have to be able to W-E, right? W-E is just press W and then press E. I just do it really fast, right? You press W and then I spam E. That's what I do. So make sure it goes off, all right? Now, the way Ezreal... Uh, actually, we used to like all two and stuff. Oh, we didn't smart cast this. Be sure you can hit that as well. You know, all that good shit. Oh, yeah, anyways. This is the, this is the special stuff. All right, so WE, right? That's basic. That gives you more attack speed. This is really good in an all-in. This is not really... Uh, it doesn't really... It's not really game-changing as much as the other stuff is, right? The other stuff is like a lot crazier, okay? So when you... It's, Ezreal's Q flash is a lot different than Caitlyn's E flash, right? Because when you Q... I'm going to Q flash, it's still aiming at where you aimed. No matter where you flash, it will always aim in at where your cr cursor is, right? You see this? You see this? It's always aiming at where my cursor is. So, um, it's like, the place you flash to, it's, Q flash is the same thing as flashing and then queuing in that direction, right? That's how you should think of it, right? So, if someone's like running away from you, make sure you're aiming like correctly Re like remember how this works or like if you're trying to like run away from someone so if i'm like trying to run away here i do this right i can do this and they'll be like what the hell i can do that whoops i didn't get there oh my god wait i just i just thought of something hold up no time to waste. oh my god oh my god i just thought of something wait what the hell I did not know I could do that. Okay, this is the other thing I was gonna teach you. Okay, this is the other thing. I, this is the E flash, right? This is your E. This is your flash, right? When you E flash, your E, it's like the same thing as flash E. Okay, flash E, all right? E flash. It's the same thing, except much faster. Much faster. You see this? Versus flash. Oops, that's not the right move. Instead of flash E, right? You E flash, right? E to where you want to go, flash in a different direction, and then it'll pretend you're eing in that direction, right? So if I say I want to hit this dummy, and I want to like, uh, what's it? You can like E and then flash and then like do that, and then you can also flash E and do that. But that's, those are both really slow. You can E at this ward, flash close, and get you can like hit him in immediately, right? Okay, now what I was surprised by was that Q flash and E flash can be done at the same time with one flash, right? It can be done, it can be done at the same time. I didn't even know. It can be done at the same time. Hold up. Wait, no, that's not right. What did I do? I was like, that's not really at the same time, is it? Wait, what did I do? Holy shit, I don't even know. Hold up. Wait, that's not right. I actually don't even know what I did. I think, I think I did like. Is that right? That can't be right. I did something crazy. Oh, I eat first. Oh my god. Let's go. Eat. Oh my god. So I eat first. Okay, it's not. It's not combining the two. I was wrong. I don't know what I did. But that was crazy. Okay, yeah, it's not combining the two. I was wrong. But it's still crazy. Okay, so what I did was E and then Q flash. Interesting, interesting, interesting. It was E and then Q flash. Okay, okay, okay. I'm learning, I'm learning some new shit with this practice tool. I'm learning some new shit with this practice tool. Oh my god. This, look at this. You can Q over. Oops, that's not right. Wait, no, that's not right either. Oops, Jesus Christ. That's not right either. What the fuck? This is very interesting. This is very interesting. I'm just like messing around right real quick. <laughs> what the fuck? I didn't know I could do this. E and then Q flash out. This is very interesting. I just learned a new thing. I just learned something. Look at this. Look at the practice tool. Practice tool has already had me learn two new things. The Talia wall thing. Talia W wall and this like 
E, e, e Q flash. E Q flash. Okay, here's the last thing. It's R flash. And you guys know how this works, right? You just press R, and you flash, right? So it looks like that. It's like, it's like Caitlyn's Q, it's like Caitlyn's Q flash. You're stuck in the animation, right? You can't do anything while you're in the animation. But you displace yourself, so if someone's chasing you, they're like, wait, what the fuck, right? They're like chasing you, and you go like this, and then you're like hidden. They'll, they have, they'll get confused for a sec, because you were doing your own, and then you disappeared. And then there's a flash animation, people are like, wait, what's going on? And they get hit. So that's, how, that's one way you can guarantee an ult. They don't know to flash it because they're like, wait, what's going on? Right? No one, not, not many people like know about this or know how to react to this. Right? So this gets like everyone. Especially in Challenger. People are like, wait, what's going on? Because usually they've like seen it all. Jesus Christ. This is just fancy. This is literally just like fancy. Holy shit. This is awesome. Dude, practice was amazing. Yeah, so E first. Or you could do this. You do that too. Wow! You might think it's useless, but when you E over this wall, people are immediately gonna turn around and look at you. You do this in the middle of five people, right? They're like, what just happened? This is so hard to watch, really. Interesting, interesting. So I learned two new things. Okay, so I can E R flash immediately. Or I can E Q flash immediately. Oops. I just can't fuck it up. Oops. <gasps> Messing up the combos. So yeah, you pretty much do this. You have to be able to do this with muscle memory. You don't want to be able to like... You don't really want to think about it in game too much. You want to do it so that you already know the uh, inputs, right? It's going to be E, Q, Flash. E, Q, Flash. I just fucked it up. But you never want to like mess it up in game. So that's why this thing is useful. Oh, I think I'm not waiting for my cooldowns. Oops. Let's see if we can do it like five times in a row. Feels bad. How did I, how did I mess that up? How am I messing this up? Interesting. Interesting. But you can just ult from the other side. The whole point is if they're walking in this direction and you need how it's not reliable. Sometimes it's not reliable just like throw out all right? Sometimes this is a this is how you guarantee someone gets hit. You bait them like this, right? That's how you that's like a like a fake guarantee. It's not really a guarantee, but because they're human and not robots, it's almost like a guarantee. Because they will turn around and they see it's a 4v1, they try, they, they all try and auto attack you with their own ability. And that's when, that's how you get them. Right? This serves almost no purpose. That's not true. That's not true. Because, trust me, trust me. It makes a world of difference. It makes a world of difference when you get to the higher ranks. Especially. Right? Right? What if uh, what if this was a Talon, and I needed I needed exactly I needed exactly E Q in order to kill him, and he's super fast. So how do I guarantee the Q? I do this. He looks. He's he's about to Q me, and I flash over. Right, right. He sees I use my escape ability, and he turns around. That's how you. That's that's how you guarantee like a Q. Right. Interesting, interesting. I can do it really fast now. Dude, practice tool is amazing. Look at this. You can just mix things in. Let's see. This is like a full combo. Full style combo. Oops. Okay, hold up. Yeah, so when you want to E into this guy and you want to flash, 
Click E here and then flash over first, right? You can get it really close. Look at that. You can get it really close. Depends on how, how late you flash. Also, that dragon is just hitting the dummy. They're too late. Yeah, it's pretty quick. Oops. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Lucian has animation cancels too. Yeah, I don't really know too much of Lucian's. His only flash trick is like Q flash, which works like Caitlyn Q flash. I don't know. Lucian doesn't really need flash to do his stuff. Flash doesn't like add too much extra except mobility. Unlike this stuff. This is like, look at how much insane stuff you can do. Right? Wait, can I throw a Q in here real quick? Wow, I can throw, I think I can throw in a Q. Whoa, okay. I didn't think I could throw, I didn't think I had enough time to throw an extra move. See, I, I threw a Q in there as well. Okay, I don't understand how my flash is like. You got, you gotta like really, wait, I did it wrong. Wait, I'm totally doing this wrong. What the hell? It's kind of slow. Oh, anyways. 